In today's exciting episode, I completely forget that Reshram's a fire type. I gotta go to Iron Brew. I get to do that cool night voice that I like to do. Oh God! And I forget how to spell the word oaf. Oh God, how do you spell oaf? Is that, I think that's how you spell it. <laughs> What's going on everyone, I'm Manny Spatters and welcome back to a Pokemon X Shiny Lock. In the last episode, we started our Elite Four challenge. Today, we are back to continue that. The Elite Four has been buffed. They are very, very strong. They have maximum AI and maximum EVs and high powered movesets, along with some pretty strong Pokemon that are actually above the level of mine. So, without further ado, Let's dive into it. So the next trainer that we're going to battle, actually, let me make sure that all of our dudes are up to scratch and we can have a run through the team too to see what we are working with today. So first off, we have ourselves Iron Brew, who is running a little bit low on meteor matches, so I potentially could ether you. We have PTRZ Prime, who seems pretty fine. <laughs> okay, I laughed at that because I, I didn't realize that was gonna rhyme. And it caught me off guard. <laughs> okay, all right, we have forehead level 66. With a focus sash, we have our Mega Bluesican, and of course, the main man himself, our carry, Terry, who is looking very fine indeed. Uh, I'm going to lead off with, I think I'm going to lead off, I'm going to lead off with Bluesican, because I think that Bluesican hasn't really had a chance to shine just about yet, so... Let's give Bluesican a shot, we got our Mega Bluesican, and we don't have any Mega Evolution conflicts in our team, which is really nice. So we don't have to worry about, oh, do I Mega Evolve this or do I Mega Evolve this? Because we only have one Mega Evolution, so we don't even have to worry about it. It's just good. All right. Ooh, it's Dragon Lady. I like her. She's nice. <laughs> Dragon Lady is nice. All right, sweet. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, this this room looks so cool. Wait, what is what is the big thing that happens? What is this? You know, there's water that comes down, there's a fire that goes up, and then there's... That's it? That's... Really? Really? That seems kind of like a misfire. I think there's some like big flames are supposed to like protrude and she's just like, oh no, it's it's not working again. Benjamin, Benjamin, it's it's not working again. Benjamin's like, all right, dr what's your face? I'll deal with it soon. The Benjamin's the caretaker of the Pokemon League, by the way. Uh, that's actually uh, confirmed in Pokemon Lord. Janitsi Masuda said, yes, uh, Benjamin, my favorite character in the entirety of Pokemon. So, let's dive into it. All right, Elite Four member number three. See what you got. Elite Four member number three. Do you think that you will? Nope. Didn't uh. Didn't didn't quite think of anything for that one. So uh. Good job, team. Get ready for the next round. Sorry, I meant to, I meant to play this one. Mission failed. We'll get them next time. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Goodness. Hello to you. Welcome. Welcome, come, come, come in, come in, have a spot of tea. You must be a strong trainer. Yes, a strong, quite a strong trainer indeed. That's just wonderful news. Facing opponents like you and your team will make my Pokemon grow like weeds. I don't know why you use weeds as an example because weeds are literally super duper annoying unless you mean the actual, you know, devil's less weeds, in which case that's illegal, I think, in France. I don't know. That's actually a good question. I have no idea if that's illegal in France. If it is, then that's illegal. If not, then, you know, it doesn't really matter, I suppose. Oh, good. Yeah, no, that's, that's, oh, wow. Wow. A Reshram that's a higher level than me and has a high powered move set with max IVs. Good. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is, okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Guess I'll just try my best. Here we go, Sacred Sword. Oh, I'm fucked. Okay. I have, a, I have a terrible feeling that Blaziken is about to lose a life here. Oh god, okay. Try your best, Blaziken. Just just try your- I wish I had Protect to scout what you were gonna do. Oh, you're dead. I'm sorry, there's no way. There's no way. There's no way you're dead. You're dead. Oh, he lived! Yes! Okay, okay, he's using Outrage. You're locked into Outrage. Oh, beautiful. It did so much damage, too. Okay, 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 okay. You're locked into Outrage. I can go into Iron Brew. Is that the play to make? Yeah. I gotta go into Iron Brew. You're locked into Outrage. Gotta, gotta make the switch. Gotta make the switch. I also have King Shield, so I can reduce the power. Oh, but you're, yeah, you're a fire type, though. Hmm. You're, you're, you, you really are a fire type, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Yeah, you're a fire type. I, uh, I completely forgot about that one. You suck, dude. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Fair. Oh, but the Rocky Helmet. Okay. You're locked into it for one more turn. I have to kill you now. 
I have to kill you now. I have to Zen headbutt you. You can't heal. You're gonna get the Rocky Helmet damage. As long as I land this Zen headbutt, you're dead. And I have nothing to worry about. Please, 85% chance. Just kill it, just kill it, just kill it. Ah, it's confused now. Okay, just kill it, just kill it. Yes! Okay, okay, thank you. All right, Reshram goes away. Whew, thankfully, Reshram does go away. That would have been really bad for my team because he would have just one-shotted my Iron Brew with some kind of Fire-type move, and then we'd be in a really bad situation. Ally switch. No. Why would I want that? Absolutely not. Thank you for the experience, though. Zapdos comes in next. Yeah, because we just have Zapdos is just chilling in the back, apparently. All right, Terry's gonna come in here. Terry has the Assault Vest, so we can take it. I'd imagine that Zapdos wouldn't really have much to attack me with. Gonna have some electric type moves, maybe some flying type moves. It's not a whole lot, and I can use this opportunity to heal up the rest of my team, which I really sorely need to do. And you should be shuddering because I have an ice beam with your name on it just waiting for you. Okay. Next thing. I need to heal up Luzkin. I need to heal up Iron Brew. Get ourselves, get our boys back up. And, ooh, boom burst. Okay. That's gonna do nothing because I have the assault vest. Oh, bless the assault vest. It's so good. All right, and then we got uh, heal up Iron Brew here. And then next to I can Ice Beam you. I grab my boom box, turn up the turbo base. That's what this Zapdos is doing right now, Jesus Christ. Okay, I should be able to outspeed you. I don't outspeed you, never mind. So you have more speed than I do because you have max IVs and I don't. Feels amazing, man. All right, goodbye Zapdos. Goodbye, oh, you lived. It has a Focus Sash, come on, man. Well, actually, that means that you are going to use a Full Restore this turn, which means that I should also use a Full Restore this turn. We're gonna trade Full Restores. We're both gonna, yeah, we're both gonna trade Full Restores this turn. That's fine, I don't mind that. I, I am totally down with it. You wanna trade? You wanna trade Pokemon cards? You wanna trade Yu-Gi-Oh cards? I'll give you a Blue Eyes for a Red Eyes? That's a terrible trade. Don't ever trade a Blue Eyes for a Red Eyes. While Red Eyes is one of my favorite cards in the entire game, it's just not a good trade because Blue Eyes, it requires the same amount of sacrifices, but has just better stats in general, and also has a lot of really good support that you can have access to now, but that's not to say Red Eyes doesn't have good support because Red Eyes has fantastic support, but still, the Blue Eyes just has the better stats, and pretend you know you get your Blue Eyes alternative dragons, you got your Maidens with Eyes of Blue, you're good. Another Gigalith, that's the second Gigalith we've seen so far. That's the second Giggle, Giggalith. <laughs> Giggalith. Gig, gig, no, okay, sorry, I uh, I, I, I thought I thought I had you with that one. I thought I had you with that one. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. Iron Brew should have this. There shouldn't be any issues here. Thank you, non-branded energy drink, for keeping me hydrated. It's non-branded. I'm not sponsored. Can't say what it is. All right. Meet your match. Here we go. That should do a good amount. E e easily over half. Easily over half. We get the attack buff. That's beautiful. And we miss the head smash. Nice. Or you miss the head smash. Much better. Okay, fair, 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 fair. Then again, you're taking all that recoil damage and then you're immediately taking Rocky Helmet damage too. Not your best move ever, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm gonna Z Headbutt now. You're gonna use another full restore. I think that's your last full restore. Wasted on a Gigalith, in all honesty. Not a good plan to waste it on the Gigalith. You have so many other Pokemon you could've used it on. Okay, that didn't do as much as I hoped it would, but still, fine. I'm gonna go for the Meet Your Mash. This is gonna kill you. This is gonna kill you. Goodbye, Gigalith. Wave goodbye to Gigalith. Goodbye, friends. All right, up next is Cryogonal. Perfect. Okay, once again, that is one Meteor Mash away from complete destruction. You are gonna outspeed me. Oh, it has Magma Storm! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, Iron Brew. Ooh, we barely... Uh-oh, oh God, I need you to kill. Okay, okay. I'm trapped by Swirling Magma. Can I switch out? If you die, can I switch out now? Or am I still trapped by Swirling Magma? Am I gonna take the damage? Am I gonna take the residual? Uh-oh. I don't know if I take the residual. Yeah, levels up, that's great. Do I take the residual? I don't take the residual. Okay, I need switch out. All right, going to blues, can Yeah, okay, Jesus Christ, that would've been... <laughs> oh, that would've been spooky. That would've been terrifying. Okay, but we're fine. A Scavalier comes in. That should be... Dark Aura. Okay, not really sure what Dark Aura does. It maybe buffs Dark type moves. I'm not really sure. We'll see. Gonna go for a Blaze Kick. Is this gonna one shot you? It probably should one shot you. Yeah, I'm a Mega Blaze Kick. I don't even know why I asked the question. Is this going to one shot you? What kind of question is that? It's a Mega Blaze Kick versus something that's quad weak to fire. This thing could look at a match and it would instantly melt Pancake. Ah, right. 
The most terrifying Pokemon of all, Stunfisk. Oh no, it's your ace Pokemon! I can just imagine the situation where, where, where she's like, Oh, you may have beaten all of my other Pokemon, but you haven't seen my ace. And the main character's like, Ugh, here comes her strongest Pokemon. I need to be ready for this. And she's like, all right, here we go, go Pancake. And this thing falls out of the Pokeball, just like slumps on the floor and just like, that's it. I mean, this, honestly, I'm not gonna lie. That did a lot of damage right there. I can't even flex, that did a lot of damage. So I will just take Restore it and take it out, but still. Pancake, really? Of all things, you had a Reshram? You had a, you had a, you had a, you had a, you had a Gigalith? You had a S Cavalier and you have a Pancake. Congratulations. Actually, it is fitting though, because I am gonna have pancakes for lunch today. So I'm actually really excited for that. Pancakes and syrup? Oh, dude, I, I'm gonna have it for lunch because I always have cereal for breakfast because I, I, you know, I, I can't skip my cereal because I love cereal. My breakfast always consists of some kind of cereal and tea and I just love it. It's my thing, dude. I love it so much. But when it comes to lunch, I'm like, fuck it. I'll have whatever for lunch. It literally does not matter because lunch is irrelevant. Uh, or, it's not irrelevant, but. Pancakes for lunch is good as, as, as good as pancakes for breakfast. Bet. It doesn't matter what time of the day that you have it because it's still delicious. Okay? No matter what time you eat a pancake, it's still as delicious as it would have been at any other time. Okay? Just wanna make that abundantly clear. Well, the other Pokemon, I'm sure you can beat the last of us. Oh, I'll beat him, dude. I'll beat him all. Uh, 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 <clears throat> mm. Yeah, I'll beat him uh, in a Pokemon battle. Sure, we'll do that in a second. <laughs> the power of the new cast and the new kings are with me today. Feeling pretty good about that. Okay, I'm just gonna use my energy roots because no reason to waste stuff when I don't have to. Get my boys all healed up. The boys are back in town, as the kids would say. And I do need to use some of these ethers now. I need to use on Ice Beam. I need to use on Meter Mash to get my things. I actually have a PP up here. So, I mean, yeah. There we go. Great. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna use these ethers because I might as well use these ones. Get okay, Ice Beam up. I'll get my Meter Mash up. And that should be good, actually. I think that should be good. All right. Last Elite Four member time. Let's see what he's all about. The Ironworks Chamber. All right, Ironworks Chamber. I am ready for the final battle. I have defeated many, many a foe before me. Many of the strongest trainers of the region have fallen at my feet. Now there leaves only one before the God King. And he has a big sword and stuff, so that's, that's cool too, I guess. That's nice. Oh, this is a really cool looking room. I'm not gonna lie. This is really cool. I'm a fan of this guy. I'm a fan of this guy. The whole medieval thing you got going on there. I'm a fan of it. I want you to know. Big fan. Huge fan. You Oh no, I didn't oh I didn't look at what I have uh the front of the party. Okay, I have I have Mega Blaze again in the front of the party. Might have been a bad idea. I guess we'll see. Alright, what can I what can I voice? I you know uh, uh, let me let me check the let me double check the voice of the, the gods in Oblivion. Stop right there, criminal scum! Well met, young challenger. Verily, I am the Elite Force famed blade of hardened steel, Wickstrom. With my magnificent Pokemon at my side, I will reveal the scope of trainer achievement. Let us both give our word that our contest shall be fair and honorable. Ready? On guard! Okay. Fair and honorable, he says. <laughs> right, right, yeah, yeah, of course, of course, dude. All right. All right, Wickstrom. Why does everyone have the same Pokemon in this? Why do you have a Zapdos? What's going on with it? What's what's what seems to be the issue here? Again, I just have to switch out into. Uh, are you gonna have a Focus Slash too? You gonna survive my Beam too? Is that what's gonna be like, Terry? You have to get out here. <sighs> Terry, there's another Zapdos. <laughs> Gotta get Terry, bi big, big scary Terry out here. God, he's so fucking cool looking. I love Terry so much. Oh, he's so good. Steam eruption. Oh, wow. Please don't burn me. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Don't, don't, don't. Hey, 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 hey. Thank you. Okay. It's gonna be a little bit upset with you. I have 12 ice beams now. This is great. If you have a focus sash, I'm gonna flip my lid. Wow. You just straight up took it. You just straight up took up a super effective ice beam. Oh my god, okay, well you can use it before restore. That's completely fine. In fact, I encourage you to use as many full restores as possible here because all you're doing is wasting your full restores. That is the only progress you- and you're dead. <laughs> I got a crit! Yay! You wasted full restore for nothing. Okay, good. <sighs> what the- what is the- what? What? 
Why does everyone in the Elite Four have the same Pokemon? I, why? Why? I don't understand it. Everyone in this elite- Oh, I shouldn't have went into PTRs of Prime because PTRs of Prime is Fairy Aura, which is gonna buff Fairy type moves against me. Which, uh, actually, you know, thinking about it again, probably wasn't a great idea. Yeah, that wasn't- Okay. Well, I mean, let's try an Iron Tail and see what we do here. Goes to the Iron Tail, we landed. Okay, 75% chance to hit. Oh my god! Wow, your mom is dead. I'm sorry to say that. I'm sorry to be the one to, to be the bearer of bad news here. Holy shit. Oh my good, blue skin, level 66, perfect. What's on egg bomb? What is this? Is this amateur hour? No, it's 11-11. On my clock right now, it's 11-11. It's not amateur hour. 11-11 is the time to, I, I, I don't know, it's time to do something, but not be an amateur, all right? All right, Braviary's coming in next. Uh, I, you know what, I'm gonna give Forehead a chance. There's no possible way that Forehead can die in one shot because I have the Focus Sash. So I feel confident, even if you have like a superpower, even if you have Surf, again, it should be fine, because there's no way I can die in one hit. Unless you get some cat styles. Oh! Yeah! Focus Sash! Nice! That makes me happy. So this is why we have the Focus Sash on, uh, on forehead right here. And that's gonna kill you. Okay, beautiful. I mean, my defense rose, but I don't know how much that's gonna help me. But okay, we took down one of those Pokemon pretty easily like that. That's, that's nice, that's nice. Of? Oh, I know what this is. This is one of the Simi Monkeys, isn't it? It's one of the Simi Monkeys. And since you're bringing it in against Forehead, it's not Simi Seer. Which means that it's either Simi Sage or Simi Poor. Which, uh, Iron Brew should be decent against either of them. So let's go into Iron Brew. You see my logical deduction right there? Wasn't it fantastic? All right, Iron Brew, let's see what you got, boy. All right, actually, it's, it's gonna be one of the simmies, bet. Yep, Simi Sage. I knew it. I absolutely knew it. Absolutely knew it. Water Spout, okay, interesting. Oh my god, that actually did decent damage. I have Cursed Body, though. And I missed! Oh god, okay, okay, I'll, I'll give you another shot. I'll give you another shot here. Let's see what you got, Simi Sage. I mean, you can't use a Water Spout again because I disabled it, so let's see what else you have. Frenzy Plants! Okay, that would have been scary if I was weak to you, but I'm not, so I'm totally fine with that. In fact, you can't even move this turn. Congratulations, you oaf. Of more like oaf. Throw, it, throw an A in between the O and the F. I'm pretty sure that spells it, oaf. Is that how you spell oaf? Oh god, no, wait, is it it? Oh god, how do you spell oaf? Is that, I think that's how you spell it. You have a leaf storm too? Jesus Christ, you really are going for, aren't you? I mean, you should be dead to this, I think. Yeah, there he goes. Dumb little simmy idiot gets knocked out here. I'm pretty sure you should be able to- Ugly. Okay, great. Oh wait, I know what this is actually. I'm pretty sure you should be able to spell out what the phrase is from the simi line that I created. And I can't remember exactly what it is, but there was some- I created a phrase of all the names for all the simi Pokemon. I can't remember what it was. That includes their pre-evolutions too. Uh, I can't remember what it was though. Uh, ugly is Groudon. Ah, this is actually scary. Okay, Terry? You know, in any situation that seems to be scary, you have to rely on your best friend, Terry. Let's get him out here. Let's get him out here. It's all down to you, Terry. You got this. Oh, no! I thought... No! A grout on his fat rat! Ugly as Magmorta. Okay, well, I'm actually a little bit, uh, a little bit concerned now. I mean, I should be okay, because I'm a dragon... Oh, I'm a dragon ice type. I have the assault vest. Oh, Vox Blast! Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, I have the salt vest. We should be okay. I have the salt vest. Calm down, calm down. Okay, okay, okay. That. There goes my assault vest. Okay, um, Focus Blast. That is fine because I can switch into Ratchet, and Ratchet should be okay. This thing is a little bit of a concern, though. I do need to get damage on him. I would like to put him to sleep if possible because I don't know if one earthquake will kill. Goes for the Focus Blast. That's fine. Please tell me I outspeed you. I, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, okay, take it! Yes! Oh god. Alright, stop! Jesus Christ, you're concerning me quite a bit here. I think Von Earthquake might be able to kill, but I just didn't want to take that chance, so... I, you know what? Wait, 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 just in case. I need to get the heals up in case you wake up like one of the turns immediately. 
gonna get my heals up here because there is a small chance that you can wake up turn one. There is a very small chance that could happen. He didn't wake up turn one, but I just want you guys to know there was a very, very small chance that that could have happened. Gonna fire off the earthquake now. Ugly is still fast asleep, as he should be. Go to sleep, you ugly duckling. No one likes you, you're terrified. Ooh, it did kill him one shot, nice, okay. I just wanted to put him to sleep just to make sure that that would happen. Okay, what's the last Pokemon? Last Pokemon is Azelf. I'm going to stay in because I'm full health and I'm feeling good. I am definitely gonna put you to sleep though. Spore is such a good move. Yo, watch out, what? <gasps> Ooh, what happened, oh no, oh no. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh my God, that does so much. Yeah, you gotta go to sleep. What if you had magic bounce? Remember when that actually, I think that actually happened one time when I tried to put something to sleep and I had magic bounce. Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, okay. Let me get myself healed up here because I, again, I don't want you waking up and just wood hammering me into the next dimension. Whew, okay. Ratchet. If I sleep level 71 Azelf in front of me right now. But as long as you don't, in fact, even if you wake up this turn, I should be okay. Yeah, okay, all right. This should kill. Please kill. This, this should absolutely kill. Shadow Punch. Takes you out. Okay, beautiful. Woo! All right, nice. Nice, 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 nice. Level 69, and all that's left to face is the God King herself. Lands Wrath? Do I actually want that? It does 90 damage. Nah, yeah, I don't think I actually want I think Earthquake's better for me. Uh, yeah, Earthquake is better for me. It has more base damage. Keep all moves. See, I like how Pokemon doesn't have that super duper power creep that, um, that other games have. Like when it comes to when it comes to adding new generations, they're all like, all of them are kind of balanced around each other essentially, and there's no super duper power creep. Like it's not like the generation one Pokemon are completely useless now, which is nice. What now? What sweet glorious pain and joy now rock my mighty heart, my will, which e shakes even which even Shakespeare's trembles at so fine a battle as this. I am undone. Good sir, you are indeed our equal and worthy to enter this lofty hall. The time has come at last for your greatest challenge. Now show our God King the same strength that you have shown us. Will do. Will do. Okay. I will become the God King. It is my destiny to unlock the chambers for which the God King sits and tear the God King's team to bits. Okay, all right, we're gonna do that next episode though. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this episode, please be sure to destroy that like button right below this video. I can't believe that we didn't lose anything. Honestly, I can't believe we didn't lose any lives at all. Feeling pretty good about that. We'll come back in the next episode. We'll become God King and we'll one, we'll finish this one way or the other. So thank you guys so much for watching. Remember, if I do black out, then that is a loss, even if I have lives left. Uh, so I'll see you guys next time. Bye.